Now, welcome to Business News. After years of research, U.S. Department of Agriculture, USAA, in collaboration with Nigeria's National Biotechnology Development Agency, uh, NABJA, has launched Biotech Cowpea. This is the first of its kind in Nigeria. According to research, uh, the Cowpea will reduce the use of uh, pesticides from eight sprays per season to about two targeted sprays and increase the yield by up to 20%. This means that Nigeria will record a revenue increase of more than 48 billion naira annually from Cowpea. Plus TV News correspondent Ngozi Gahaches reports. Beans is one of Nigeria's staple foods, but consumer taste buds is about to experience something new. The Council of Agricultural Affairs U.S. Mission in Nigeria, Gerald Smith, says the new beans will improve nutrition and food security across Nigeria. Eating is believing it's a community engagement activity that is helping to boost the demand for BT cowpea and healthy bean-based food products. The cowpea or bean is incredibly nutrient-dense and rich in vitamin A and C, including micronutrients. Plants are on to distribute the biotech cowpea seedlings to farmers by the first quarter of 2022. It's readily available to the farmers. Probably in Lagos, uh, a lot more work has to be done to make it uh, available. But it is available where I come from. And uh, I think the Ibadan in Oyo State, there is a company that is interested in uh, producing it commercially, so Lagos will be covered, and all of Nigeria will be covered, you know, uh, finally. Traditionally, oh, it's, something, it's something known that beans is nutritious. It has a high protein content, but uh, fingers are not equal. Even among the cowpeas, there are some cowpeas that may have differences in terms of high protein content. So this one is among those ones, because it has more than 24% uh, crude protein content, and also with high iron and zinc, which is also needed. That was why some farmers, uh, women, especially in the rural areas, where they cannot afford uh, meat, and also fish, a source of protein, they can use it as an alternative, because uh, that one will supplement uh, what they are needing, or uh, what they lack in terms of the protein supplement. That will really help. And especially for the women, women that are pregnant, pregnant women, that will also help them. Because even the, uh, the conventional coffee, Look, doctors used to advise them to say you'll be adding beans into your product so that at least you'll be taking some kind of essential element like iron and zinc and so on and so forth. The biotech beans is made into bean cake and pudding. Participants and farmers explore the new taste. <laughs> One assurance is consistent here on the lips of experts and data is the biotech cow pee is safe to the health. For Plus TV Africa, Ngozika or Hi Chessy. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.